to Spruce Meadows here in the foothills of the Rocky Mountains for this match between Cavalry and Atletico Ottawa. Atletico Ottawa has dominated this fixture with six wins in the eight previous meetings, and Cavalry are desperate for a W of any kind. Tommy Wilden Jr. and his side back in a 4-2-3-1 with three changes to the 11. Frazier Aird in at right back, Udoka Chima in at center back. Carlos Gonzalez, okay, let's just make the one change today. And it's a notable change as Malcolm Shaw is added to the team. Johnny Dos Santos, a bit surprisingly, drops to the bench center, goes to the ground, and they will have an opportunity out of it. Luke has won this free kick, he's going to take it himself and goes for goal right at Carucci. His first test is answered with a confident catch just on his goal line. If you can manage your bench, like Tommy Wilden has tried to do here, I mean, you've got speed, you've got some physicality, and holding a shift. This is Sergio Camargo! Skies it over the bar! Meyer Bremen was there as an option as well. Big opportunity for the Cavs now. Escalante line drive in. Camargo chases down! I know he's good in his own right, but you just oh, need oh, guys oh, 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 oh. that have played so many games and know what it's like to perform week in and week out. Speaking of performing week in and week out, here's Mason. It's a bubble on the way down. Daly perfectly weighted in front of Sergio Camargo. Waiting for help to arrive and finds it in air. Cuts back towards back and a touch to control and a huge block just in front of the penalty mark from Diego Espejo. Final seconds of the three minutes of added time, it's Kopsa. Didn't have a lane towards Moussi, is able to work it to Frazier Aird. Aird across into the box, not by Camargo. Aird dropping it back for Moussi. Camargo out wide, Aird a better cross, looking for Bevan, it's gonna sit for Escalante. and brought it back for an offside on Meyer Bevan. So obviously not the first time. We're going to watch Bevan here, nine. He is behind Espejo now, behind everybody, quite frankly. So in the referee's eyes, Bevan did enough to disrupt and prevent Sean Melvin from being able to make that save. I don't know. I think that's harsh. Aaron getting his troops organized. Waves can turn off. Aaron into the box. Moosey goes! has clicked, finally found something. And you credit Cavalry as well for how much they brought this game to Atletico Ottawa. 
And with only four minutes remaining, they need some more of that offensive magic. For Hoven, confident after his goal last time out. Tries to test Carducci from outside the box. And now the Moosey nearly got it over the wall. They finally done it. For the first time in 2023, Cavalry into the win column. And you know what it means to this side, especially after coughing up a lead last week. They emphatically defeat Atletico Ottawa on the day on goals from Sergio Camargo and Dan Klopp.